In California, more acres have burned in 2020 than any year in the past three decades. But the increase in wildfire activity is happening up and down the entire West Coast. And as CBS 13's Dina Kupfer explains, it could play a big role this flu season. Hazy skies and poor air quality, ailments we deal with in California every wildfire season. But as we prepare for the flu season ahead, there's another health risk to consider. A new study suggests there is a link between the delayed effect of wildfire smoke and an increase in influenza cases the following winter season. Well, I think we should be concerned. Local pulmonologist Dr. Peter Murphy says there is a direct correlation between poor air quality and respiratory illness. That injury from particulate matter today will increase your risk of a viral infection at six to nine months to a year from now. The study found in communities plagued by wildfire smoke, the cases of asthma increased, as well as respiratory infections like pneumonia and bronchitis, resulting in more hospitalizations. Uh, cells from the lungs, when they're exposed to air pollution, uh, their uh, ability to be infected with influenza is dramatically uh, increased. Dr. Murphy says the best way to protect your health during the smoky season is to be sensible about your exposure. Well, you know, I think we can clearly limit our exposure. I mean, this is not a time uh, to be doing outdoor exercise. So researchers concluded predicting flu outbreaks based on climate and environmental factors like wildfire smoke may be important in public health planning in the future.